Hello everybody, DTX720 here. How is, how's everybody doing? Um, everybody having a great time, everybody having a great new year. This episode is be being recorded and will be uploaded on the very first day of 2020. It's been a whole decade since the year 2010 and wow it's crazy and it's flown by and just just 10 years ago I was 11 and now I am here in August still a little bit away a couple months away but I'm always about um, six months ahead of the date but it's crazy that in 2010 I was 10 slash 11 and here in 2020 I'm going to be 20 slash 21 come August but in the beginning of the year, I'll just, I'll be even with the number. It's crazy how the world has gone, you know. Been 20, I've been around on this planet for 20-ish, give or take years. And hell, it's been a fun ride, and a big reason why my life has been so fun is because of what we're playing right now. It's good old classic Pokemon games and everything relating to them. Let's make sure our team's healed up. And then we'll give you a summary of what we got going on right now. Here's a little look, a little look see at our current team. These guys right here, at least the current plan, um, unless I get tired of one of them, is this is our final team. We have. Let us go to our Pokemon. Let's go to summary mode, not swap mode. Summary mode. And we'll start off with Scenta Scorch. I butchered it. I stuttered. Scorch, who is a fire bug type, and he is a killing machine. There we go. Here's our boyo Scorch. We have our girl Dredna, our female Dredna, who's spiky and looking mean as always. Also another monster on our team. A lot of our Pokemon hit really hard. There's a lot of great Pokemon in these games, man, in the 8th generation. Then we got Corvusquire, our flying type, who will soon be a flying steel type. As soon as he evolves into Corviknight. Then we have Thwacky, our starter, who evolved from Grookey. And he's kind of in his ugly middle stage right now. We're going to ignore that and we're going to move on to Hitana, who looks like a cute little Kirby character. And we love her so. But uh, she does need to speed up a little bit because she always gets wrecked by moves she's weak against due to them outspeeding her. And then we have our new um, member of our team who has just replaced Boltund, Rip Boltund. Well, he's not dead, but we put him in the box for now. We have Toxel, and Toxel is going to be replacing Boltund as our electric type, and he is an also he is also a poison type. And he's a naughty nature, so he's going to evolve into an amped Toxtricity, which is what I've been looking for. The other Toxels I caught we're all um, like low-key natures, which um, I prefer the amped version myself because it looks way cooler. Anyways, we're going to hop on our bike and we're going to continue back on Route 6 where we left off last episode. Whoops, almost drove off the bridge there. That would not be good. Alrighty, let's get across this bridge right here. And then we'll hop off the bike and continue back where we were. Bam. Let's go on down. Let me make sure. Let me see who's at the front of our party here. <clears throat> I'm going to put Hatena in the front here to get, so she can get some experience. Actually, you know what we're going to do? We are going to... Got that old letter. Okay. Got Charm, which I'm not going to teach to anybody. Would it be a smart idea to learn teach Santa's Course Skull? I have no clue. Let me... Pretty much uh, smoothing out my inventory for a moment. Okay, I was thinking I'm gonna give Toxel one of these. Just give him one for now. Ooh. Let's give him one more. Okay, he's on the verge of level 29. Excuse me, sorry, that was really loud. I hope that didn't murder anybody's ears. Apologies if it did. 
I kind of like in between episodes I got like frog in my throat. Let me take a let me take a nice little sip. <clears throat> Excuse me. Jesus. Well, we've been staring at this beautiful lady here. Let us fight her. Um, actually, lady, can I not fight you? I see a glaring yaw mask right there, and I would like to catch that. Hello, beauty, Anita. You are beautiful. You are a good-looking lady. Okay, Hatena. Can you can you take him? I don't think you can. That is a, a Clefairy. What does that Clefairy know? We're not gonna take the chance. We are gonna switch into Toxel, maybe. Might be a bad idea, but let's swap in a Toxel because Fairy types, which is what Clefairy is are weak to okay he's using metronome don't hit me with something hard please sparkling aria okay is that gonna hurt me it didn't hurt that much and i was a crit so that didn't hurt at all let's use acid and see how much damage it will do probably won't do too much but yeah there we go <clears throat> hopefully it doesn't get a lucky metronome here. Payday. All right. Okay, so she's gonna get money for that. We're gonna do another acid and then pray that we live another metronome. I should have nuzzled. I should have nuzzled and paralyzed the sucker. The mother sucker. Oh God, overheat's gonna kill me. Yeah, that killed me. God damn it. You son of a gun. Huh? Alright, no matter. Let us... It doesn't really matter who we go into, because it's going to keep using... It's just going to keep using Metronome. Playing games with us. Let's use Fury Attack and try to hurt it enough. Yeah, that'll kill. And I got a crit. Hey, 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 I don't, I'm not in love with you. Kill it. Kill it before you love it more. That's, that's how life works, people. If, if you love something, never mind. No, that's terrible, what I was going to say. You have another? Now you have a, you have a Clefable also. Is it going to metronome me as well? You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to... I'm gonna revive Toxel. Just so that he can get the experience from this battle and evolve. Yep, of course you're using Metronym. Get out of here. Wish. Oh my god, I used Wish. Too bad it didn't matter. Let's use Fairy Attack on it. It'll do some decent damage. And it avoided the attack. Wow. Psychic fangs. Psychic fangs? That's a move? Okay, why are you avoiding the attack? This is not good. Sand tomb. Doesn't affect me. Yeah, it doesn't affect me. I'm gonna pluck you, dude. I'm gonna pluck your eyebrow right off. I'm gonna steal it. Stop metronoming. Happy hour? What does happy hour do? Did you just heal yourself? Give itself a happy atmosphere? What are these moves? I've never heard of the move happy hour. I've been playing Pokemon for a decade and I've never heard of this. Oh, charm. God. You're really gonna charm me. What's peck? Pecker. Peck. Oh my god, it didn't do anything. Tail whip. Okay. Pluck. 
pluck. Pluck again. Stop metronoming me. Stop. No. Stop wagging your finger. Gla grass pledge. Grass pledge. Metronome is such a trippy, trippy move, man. Just lets you do whatever. <clears throat> no, why won't you die? You fat, you fat creature. Oh, take down to hurt. Ooh, that hurt. Now you're dead. See what you did? Now you're dead. You deserve every second of it. Every second counts. And Toxel has evolved. I mean, not evolved. He's leveled up. And he will evolve right now. Ooh, and Hatena is level 32. I believe Hatena is about to evolve too. We have two evolutions going on here. Hell yeah. Yes, Queen Slay. Hatena! What? Hatena is evolving? Yes, evolve, beautiful creature. <clears throat> wow! Your Hatena evolved into Hatrum. Hatrum! <laughs> How cute! You evolved. Hopefully, your speed got a little better. Brutal swing. Let us. Sure, we'll teach you Brutal Swing. Should I teach you Brutal Swing? No, I'm not going to teach you Brutal Swing. No, yeah, you're not learning Brutal Swing. Sorry. You have better special attack than you do physical attack, so you're not learning that. And then, Toxel! Yes! Are you ready to reach your full potential, little Toxel? You're gonna become the most, one of the most badass, yeah, rock on! The most badass Pokemon ever! I love Toxtricity. It has potential to become one of the best Pokemon of all time, I believe. Just by design alone. I love its design so much. I just love the design of most, um, electric type Pokemon. <laughs> like, uh,. My one of my favorite Pokemon of all time is one of my favorite Pokemon of all time is Electabuzz, and this guy kind of gives me that kind of vibe. Kind of. So of course, different look due to the poison typing and stuff, but you can kind of see what I mean. And we're gonna we're gonna go after this guy right here, and we're gonna catch him momentarily. Yes, we have two evolved Pokemans. Yes. So how are we gonna handle this? We need the shield. Okay. Need this. Okay. I think you're ready. I think I can catch you right now. Depending on how what's your uh, catch rate. Stay in the ball. Just let me have you. Thank you. Um. Yeah, a uh, Galarian Yamask evolves in a weird way. Um, he evolves into a thing called Runarigus. He doesn't evolve into a Galarian Cofagrigus. He evolves into Runarigus, which, which like evolves when it's like level something, and you. I'm like have to walk under like this thing in the dust bowl. Was that Naxu? <clears throat> um, don't know what I should do here. I could have jumped off that ledge; it wouldn't have mattered. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm so sorry, guys. I feel like I'm blowing out everybody's eardrums. Oh, I did not want to run into that Naxu. Can I ask you a question? <laughs> oh god. Oh my god. 
I'm just kidding, we're out of here. Goodbye, Axio. Hope you have a good life. What is that? Oh, Jesus. Okay, let's go up here. Let's go up here, and... Hey, look, there's a thing there. Oh, well, we're stuck here. Well, what happens if we fish right here? Anything different? No, it's a Magikarp. Okay. How lovely that we met you, Magikarp. Look at you. Couldn't get away. Are you serious? You're not going to let me get away from a Magikarp. Thank you. Jeez, Louise. I want the TM and the sparkly thing. Alright, looks like we're going to have to go there a different way. Okay, so let's press on. Pressing on. Let's just fight these people. We're going to have to do it eventually anyway. Fight me. Fight me, scrubs. This is going to be a double battle. Yes. Ponyard. And a Togetic. Gonna use Dazzling Gleam on Ponyard. Oh, on both, actually. And then we are going to. Gonna pluck Togetic. Just for good measure. Pluck you. <laughs> Pluck you, Togetic. Kill the Ponyard. No, it didn't kill. Ah, uh, news life do. I knew that move once. Did it heal him all the way? You're a pain. Oh, what a what a pain in the butt. I'm oh, sorry. I, I paused because I was trying to listen. I was wondering what that noise was. It was all. Fun. Um, you know what, let's go into Toxtricity. Let's look at both of our our new guys, our newly evolved Pokemons. Oh, look how cool he is. Let's have them both out here. Metal Claw did not much. Dazzling Gleam will hurt Ponyard immensely. Fairy Wind, it didn't hurt that much. Okay, let's dazzle and gleam the both of them again, and then let us use acid on both of them, I guess. I didn't know I could use it on both of them. It doesn't fit, yeah, I know it doesn't fit. But it will hurt Togetic, and then... Whoa! Not cool, man, not cool. And then I'll dazzle and gleam both of you and hopefully kill both of you. Yes! You both die. Die. Good job, you guys make a lovely team. I didn't know Acid hit two people at once. Yeah, yeah, complain, complain. Give me money. Which one do we go up first? Does it matter? No, it doesn't. Well, there is a Yamask right here that's gonna touch my face. Don't touch my face. Okay, we'll fight you. Gym Challenger. Backpacker Diane? Diane? Diane. Diane. Oh, it's a sock. Oh, sock's gonna hurt me. Sock is gonna hurt me. You can't run. Oh, he was bulk up. Stupid decision. Kill. Please kill it. One shot it. Which side shot? One shot it. One shot it. One shot it. Oh, I did one shot. Ooh. Do we want to risk it? Oh, I don't want to risk it. He's going to hurt us. Oh, I bulked up again. Terrible idea. Okay, we got lucky. That Sock didn't want to touch us because Sock is strong. And he's faster than us, but we do have type advantage. There we go. Sock. 
You just got sock, sock. Yeah. I got Kova Squire. Wants to learn drill pick. Sure thing, buddy. Well, drill pick is better than normal pick, so. Let's do that. Learn drill pick. And Santa Scorch is level 33. Noise. Alrighty then, let us go wherever else we need to go. Should we go this way? I feel like these are gonna, yep, yeah, these are gonna take us different ways. Okay, wait, 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 don't touch me. Two rare bones. Okay, fight me. Let's fight. Come on, get over with. Model, you're a model. Scaroopy. Okay, Scaroopy's gonna hurt Hatchram. Hatchram could also hurt Scaroopy, I believe, due to the psychic ability. <clears throat> but we're gonna get out of here, and we're gonna go into Dreadna, and we're gonna smash the bug. We're gonna smash this scorpion. Dude, you dare bug bite Dreadna? Dreadna is gonna wreck you. Bam. Dunion rings. That's what you call Dunion rings. Were you? I didn't see who you were sending in, so... Oh, Ponyard. I think Dreadnought could probably take Ponyard as well. Let's use Waterfall. So I, I taught Dreadnought Waterfall, and the animation for it is really cool. And it's a way better move for Dreadnought as well. I believe I taught it to, him by, uh, to her by a TR. It's a very good, um, very good move for Dreadnought, who is a physical attacking water type, and Waterfall is a physical attacking water type move. And we got a crit there, even though it didn't matter because he was gonna die anyway. Goodbye, Ponyard. Anything else? Toxtricity's already evolved another level. Level 31. We are going to take a quick second. Let us survey our surroundings. Yep, okay, there's a lady there. Is there a person down here? I feel like there is. Oh, there is. Okay, well, we're gonna take a second real quick. No, not bag. No, not bag. Camp. We're gonna, we're gonna set up a tent real quick, and we're gonna camp. Hello, guys. We are going to cook. We're gonna, we're gonna get everybody's health up. Let's use some of these nasty pungent roots. Wait, what is it? Um, one of many ingredients that could be used in a camp. Though carelessly picked, these herbs can add. A fragrant scent to a dish. Okay. Full of sourness, sweetness. Um, I'm just gonna put a bunch of random berries because I'm not I'm not good at I don't like reading all that stuff. So hopefully this is a good uh, a good little soup or whatever, a good curry. Sorry if you guys hear me. Mash an A button. Ugh, gotta mash it. Gotta keep them fires going. There we go. Thank you, everybody. Let's get a good stirring motion going. Yep, right here. Not too fast, not too... Not too fast and not too slow. Just a perfect even stir. 
Yes, this is how you camp, people. This is how you make a curries. And we're gonna throw it now. Bam. Seemed to have landed in the short green area. So let us see if everybody enjoyed it. Hopefully it doesn't taste like but Spicy herb medley curry. It's sparkling. Does blue mean good or is blue mean bad? Okay, never mind. I think they like it. Yes, they're... He's... Ooh, it's Cop Raja class. Nice. See, that was a good class one. How you doing, buddy? How's everybody doing? Everybody doing good? Everybody having a good time? You guys looking at something? You guys are weird. Staring off in space. Oh well, Hatrim learned, uh, went to level 33. Alright, cool. I guess let's come down here. Hello, girl. Yes, I did just improve my curry decks. Throw out throw, eh? Hmm. The question is, is throw more physically defensive? Oh wow, I was faster than throw. That is a first. Ooh, I'm gonna die. No, I'm not. Wow, it looks like I became a lot less uh, frail after after leveling up so that's really cool um nice i didn't think i'd be able to hang with the throw but look at that i did usually a sock destroyed hat hatrim or hatter had a little blah, blah, blah i can't remember what the first one was called already it's already left my mind i just know that it's hatrim now let's get some berries from this tree let us bug the tree for berries and see if we're attacked by a squirrel or a cherry. We were attacked by a squirrel. A greedent! Looking like he came straight out of a Warner Brothers cartoon. Yes, yes. What will kill you, greedent? What will kill you the most? I guess Psyshock should do some good damage. And I'm faster than the squirrel as well. Look at that. Nice. Ouch. Oh my god. Holy crap. Holy crap. Alright, let's get out of here. Actually, why can't I just run? There we go. Why didn't I do that in the first place? <laughs> oh, so if I oh if I run, I don't get the berries. Oh, oh bother! Oh, I didn't mean to run into whoever that was. Oh, but look, it's a silicobra. Well, I already caught a silicobra when I was traversing the wild area, so I do not need another silicobra. But thank you anyway, silicobra, for trying to indulge yourself upon me. There's a ladder there. All right, steel wing, nice. We will immediately teach that to Corvus Squire. We're gonna immediately do that because Corvus Squire needs a couple better moves. Let us immediately teach steel wing. Oh, he can't learn it yet. It has to be evolved first. That's a bummer. Why can't he just learn it? Go down the ladder. Thank you. Excuse me, excuse me. What is this? A rare candies. Some rare candies. Do you guys like my singing? It's majestic, isn't it? Some rare candies. 
Should we go down there or should we go back around? I think I'm gonna go back around. Because if we go over this ladder over here, there is an Axio or Heliolisk Helioptile. I'm a Heliolisk Helioptile. Gonna run into my face, but I was gonna say we're gonna go over this way and go up that ladder, which I believe leads to that TM over there. Leave me alone, Helioptile. You as well. No. No. Torkoal. Dorko! Um, you haven't lived your life this... You haven't lived your life if you didn't, uh... Grow up imitating the noises that Pokemon made in the anime when you were younger. I'm telling you, you never lived. You never lived. Let's go up here. I was correct. What is this? Two fossilized dinos. Okay. Found two fossilized dinosaurs. And I found TM for Dig. Nice. Dig. It's pretty apropos. What's up? I did just make them curry. Oh, look, it's you. It's Miss. Uh, it's the woman who creates the abominations. Hello. You're careless, yes. Yeah, you are careless. Let's bring this guy to... Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I hit yes and I didn't mean to. Let's bring this abomination to life. Arctazolt. We got Arctazolt. Ah, Arctazolt. Oh my god, this poor abomination. Please go to the box, you poor creature. Oh god, I was gonna- I feel like I'm gonna cry just looking at that poor son of a bitch. Okay, well, I do not have any more fossils to revive, so when I do, I will give it a shot. Did I make sure to check over here? Is there anything else going on over here? Oh yeah, let me go down here. Almost missed out on that. Okay. Can you not? Can you not? Thank you. Light clay. Okay. And we're gonna head back this way. And we're gonna go back up here and we're gonna go the way, the way we are meant to go. We're gonna go through here and we're gonna fight this person. Let's, uh, who's in the front right now? Let's give you a fresh water. And then, I guess a super potion. There we go. Nice. Now you're healed up. Let's fight this person. What are you? Oh my goodness. Artist. Duncan. Artist Duncan is a psycho. Oh my goodness, guys. Are you seeing this? He. He's a psycho. He is a psycho. Oh my goodness. Seems like we're starting to outspeed most things at this point. Which is good. Good things. Good things indeed. Thwack is now level 34. I believe when he gets to 35 or 36, he evolves. And we're going to switch Pokemon because Sudowoodo is a rock type. We are going to go into Flacky. Speak of the devil. I believe, like I was saying again one more time, I'll repeat it. I think Wacky evolves at level 35 or 36. Six. I think it might be 36. And I think in most Pokemon games it is. It is 35. Even. 
well, I guess 36 would technically be more even of the numbers, but usually it's 35 rather than 36. I may be wrong there, though. Let's kill the Suto Wuto. What is Suto Wuto based off of again? It's, um. What is it called? Petrified Wood? Is that what it is? Petrified Wood? I think. Petrified. Yeah, that sounds right. It's like wood that's like as hard as a rock. Hey man, did you lose your crazy? You kind of look normal now. Now that you. No, okay, you're back to being crazy again. Alright. I'll just let you, um, do you, man. He's nice, Diglett. Diglett Doug Trio. Statues. Hey, and look where we are now. Is this the town of Stoneside? Uh, and there's a fighting type champ. Hello, lady. Can I? I knew I could go back here. What's back here? A dusk stone. How lovely. Let's go inside the Pokemon Center. Heal up our guys. Let's talk to some of these peoples. Let's heal up. Also over here. Even though I just healed up a minute ago, but... Let's heal up just to be safe. It's free after all. Look at our team. It's coming together so well. Almost everybody is where they need to be. Hello, sir. You're not selling Ultra Balls yet? I wish you were. Okay. Thanks anyway. Hello, man. What's up? Got some good stuff for me? Oh, you have the other two. Okay. Cool. Well, we have the other two. Wait, what? Did, wait, hold on. He said something about a digging duo. What did he say? Give some tips about the fossils. The professor or six are strong with you. If you want to collect different fossils... Go to the wild area and search for them by yourself, or ask the digging duo. You know what? We might do that. We might we might go find we might go jack around and try to find those fossils. Let's ask this guy. Hey man, what's today's bargain? Got a cracked pot? Let me buy it. So we're gonna buy that cracked pot because we can use it on Sinisty. Do you have nothing else? Alright, cool. Hello, Maractus. What are you selling? Nothing? Alright. What are you selling, bro? Today I'm buying a pearl string for $2.50. Okay, well, if I can find a string of pearls, I'll give it to you. Can you not talk crap about the Maractus like that? <laughs> I don't know if that kid should be inside the Bronzong's head like that. 2x special attacks. Let's walk in through people's houses. Hey, Granny. You the one I seen uh, at the root over there? Can I take anything from you guys? Is there anything I can steal from you? No. Okay. Thanks, anyways. I know I can go back here, though. And find some... Diglets. Oh, little diglets. Remind you, these are three diglets. These are not. These are not. The trails. Yeah, diglets. Okay, moving on. Let us. Uh huh. Let us let out our inner. Become our inner Super Mario, or Spider Man. Why did I say Super Mario? I guess it reminded me of Odyssey climbing on top of buildings. What's up, man? What are you trading? Wait, what? 
you happen to catch a lot of Maractus, how about trading one for my Hatena? Well, I would do that, broski, but I already have a Hatena, so I don't need that. And I got a Metal Coat. Look at that. I can evolve a Steelix or a Scyther to a Scissor. Venoshock. Alright, Venoshock is a good move that I can teach to a friend to friend um, Toxtricity. Which we will do so momentarily. Let us teach Venoshock to Toxtricity. Gonna teach it Venoshock for now until we can get something like Sludge Bomb or something. Because I believe, yes, wait, actually, no, his special attack stat is pretty high. His attack stat's pretty even with it as well, though, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Can I get rid of. Mm, uh, let's get rid of Flail. I don't see the use in flailing. So let's get rid of that. Alrighty. And let's move on. Let's get out of here. Okay. Let's um, talk to some people and then let's go talk to freaking Hop over here. Um, before I go bugging Hop, let's, um, I want to go back in the Pokemon Center real quick. And I want to see if I talk to this guy. No, not the nickname. No, not the nicknames. Um, remember a move. And let's go to Toxel, or Toxtricity, sorry. Still getting used to it. Toxtricity. What is this move? Belch, oh my goodness. Um, Thunder Shock, Acid Spray, Charge, Shockwave, Scary Face, Taunt, Screech, and Swagger. Okay, nothing too great. Let's see if Hatchram, I don't think it would have changed at all, but see if Hatchram has anything that could be of great use. Confusion might be. No, nothing really at the moment. Okay, thank you, sir. Um, let's, let's, uh, I wanted to look at this guy right here. Pretty well-rounded. Punk Rock boosts the power of sound, sound-based moves. This Pokemon takes also takes half the damage from these kinds of moves. Okay. So if we teach him something like Hyper Voice or something like that, it will. It could help. Actually, do I have Hyper Voice? I felt like I had that. No, I don't. I feel like I could have bought it somewhere though. I feel like I've seen that. I've seen that somewhere. Hyper voice, I've seen it. Okay, let's go talk to Hop. BTX. You seem a lot less happy, bro. I'm still not sure what I should do about the stuff that I told you before. About being weak and dragging down Lee's good name and all. But the only thing I can do is get stronger, right? So I'm gonna make a difference and see what works. You're on, bro. Let's do this. Alright, man. So, about you trying to, like, think you're not a loser or anything, you're, you're gonna lose this one, okay? You're gonna, you're gonna lose this battle. And, uh, this guy's gonna gulp Miss Lus, I assume. Hello, Cramorant, you derp bird. You derpy derpy bird. 
Okay, he's using dive, so he is gonna gulp missiles. I believe. Couldn't hit him magically because he dived. It's magical leaf again. It's gonna use dive. It hurt quite a bit, and it got an Aracuda in its mouth. Ooh, I didn't do that much damage. Oof, gulp missile hurts. Wow, that's like a pretty amazing ability there. Switch out. Go into Thwack. Thwack, you will hurt you. He's gonna pluck me, which hurts. Oh my goodness. Yeah, why did I switch in? I forgot that grass types are also weak to birds. Um. He is faster than Cramorant, though. And he killed him. Okay. And a crit. Thank you, Thwacky. I needed that. Thank you. That one was critical. Totally tubular, dude. Hell yeah, man. Sending out Toxel, bro. Um, we're gonna switch out then. I believe Hatrim can take a Toxel. This might be a terrible idea because he might not. Hatrim might be slower than Toxel. Depends if he has something that can cover a psychic type. Psyshot. Okay, I, I was fast here. I was mistaken. And he's dead. Goodbye. You know, mine is gonna be way cooler than yours, dude. Like, my, my Toxtricity, I have one. You know, they're way cooler. Like, yours sucks. Sucks. Drizzle. Switch Pokemon, and let's go into, let's go into Toxtricity, and let's have him fight against Drizzle. We'll get a stab, super effective, discharge or spark, whatever, whatever move I have. Spark, okay. Just land. It's not going to do much because that's a sound based move. I believe round is a sound based move. I had notes, so that should have been. A of course, you use the super potion, but it won't save you. You will die with this hit. I'm sorry. Goodbye, Drizzle. Go cry out your emo phase and return as uh, James Bond later. Let's learn toxic. Get an old move, let's see. You know what, we're gonna get rid of acid. We're gonna learn toxic. Because if we have toxic, and we toxic somebody, and then we hit them with venom shock, it will murder them. It will literally destroy them. Because venom shock does more damage if the opponent is poisoned. Yes, it does. Pop wants to send out Celicobra. Okay, and then that's a different one. Celicobra. We'll die to the hand of Thwacky. Thwacky will murder Celicobra's face. You can do it, Hop. I believe in you. Don't uh, don't get all depressed on us. Hello, Silicobra. Goodbye, Silicobra. Ooh, you lived. You lucky ducky. Ooh, you paralyzed me, eh? Not cool. Aha! I've been playing with my Pokemon in Pokemon Camp! Sorry, y'all. Effects have nothing on me. Yes. Alrighty. 
Well, we fought Hop and Stone Side. We have kicked his butt. We have sent him back where he belongs. Don't be depressed. You switched up your members. Yeah, I know. You're not weak, bro. You're good. You're great. You're not rubbish. Yeah, make yourself better, man. Come back stronger from this. That child. Gym challenges should battle for the sake of their own Pokemon. Why worry about saving the champion's name when we all have unbeatable? Anyways, here's something for letting me watch your battle. Well, you didn't really let me watch your battle. I didn't let you watch it, but... Alright. The gym challenge is about having fun. You think? Are, are you the other fossils? <laughs> are you... Are, oh, okay. I think, I think she was one of the other fossils. Hey, let's go up this ladder real quick. Let's see what's up on top of this building, and then we're gonna... We're gonna call this one an episode. I got a cracked pot. Well, hell yeah. Oh, hey, look. Look where that took me. All right, everybody. Well, we have made it to Stoneside. We're about to head to that gym right back there. If you can see it. Hey, man, calm down about to head into this gym right here in the next episode but i want to tell you guys everybody thank you so much for watching i hope everybody has a great new year this is the first day of 2020 after all i hope everybody has a, a great year i hope everybody has a great night happy new years see you later everybody i love you 3000 have a great day